morning. Thank you for joining us. I'm Bridget Namata. Sam has the night off. A grieving family is looking for answers after their loved one died in a fire at Campbell Industrial Park Thursday. Nikki Schenfeld spoke with family and friends in our top story. Nikki. Bridget, two employees with Green Auto Recycling were taken to the hospital with severe burns on Thursday. One man remains in critical condition. The other man, identified as 28-year-old Robert Bowers, died from his injuries. Robert Bowers went by his middle name, Chris. He was born on Kauai, moved to Kahalu'u, and most recently lived on West Oahu with his girlfriend, Kaui. He leaves behind two daughters, ages two and four. Chris was a wonderful dad to our daughters. Um, and he was really selfless, and he just wanted to live life to the fullest. And he did everything he could for not just me and the girls, but anyone who needed help and who came to him for help. Bowers had only been working at Green Auto Recycling for about two months when on Thursday a fire broke out. He was rushed to the hospital in critical condition. His best friend at his side once he heard the news. He, they, he was on life support. He said it looked like Bowers had burns over his entire body. Well, he was medicated the whole time, so they said that he didn't feel anything, but... Yeah, he was really my brother. <laughs> HFD still unable to determine what caused the fire. I'm told they're waiting for the other victim to recover. Bowers' Ohana left with unanswered questions. All I want to know is um, what happened and why myself and my two daughters don't have them with us and we don't have that chance to do everything we wanted to do. And I just want Chris and our daughters to know just um, how much he was loved and is still loved. And I reached out to Green Auto Recycling for comments, but have not yet heard back. Bridget. So tragic. Thank you, Nikki.